Hi guys, in this tutorial I will show you how to make a 3D track particles effect very easy and quick in After Effects. First of all let's click on track camera and wait until analyzing is done. And once it's done, select some points, then right click and select create null and camera. Now let's create new solid layer. I will name it particles and then make sure to make solid size slightly bigger than your composition. I will make it 2000 by 2000 and then hit OK. Let's move particles layer above track null and then apply CC particle world effect on it. Now I will solo particle layer, because we can see it better and make changes easier. Expand grid and guides and toggle off everything under it. Now expand particle and then scroll to the end of your particle layer to see them clearly. Let's change particle type now, I love to choose faded sphere or a tetrahedron. This one looks cool to me and I have used it in one of my latest reels on Instagram and some of you asked me to make a tutorial. So once you have chosen yours, make sure to bump up max opacity to 100%. We can also change colors of birth and death. I will change birth to something like white and a death to something purple or pink. Let's play around with birth and death size. I like to keep them as small as possible, but in your case you can resize them as you wish. Now let's expand physics and I will set gravity to zero. Note, negative values will make your particles go down and the positive values will make them go up. I like to keep gravity at zero, cause particles will float, but it depends on you and your video, make changes that will make your video look better. Now let's change extra to zero and then expand producer. Start increasing radius X, Y, and Z until the video will be covered with particles. Once it's cool to you, play around with birth rate, it makes your particles more or less, then slightly increase longevity as well. So now we can unsolo particles layer and then enable 3D on particles layer to track them with your clip. Press S now and scale particles layer until they will be fully covered. That's it, in case if you want make some changes, feel free to make any changes later as well. Finally I will add glow on particles, I will use a deep glow plugin, if you don't have it, feel free to DM me on Instagram a word, plugins, and wait for my reply. Hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and like the video please.